Hello everyone, my name is Sinner and we've got something new for you today. However, before we get into the video, I'd like to take a moment to tell you that nearly 70% of people who watch our videos are not subscribed. If you're not subscribed, you could do me a huge favor by liking the video, commenting below, subscribing to the channel, and ringing that bell. It really helps with the channel and lets me know that you're liking what I'm making. Alright, without further ado, let's get into the video. That's fine. Four, five, six, seven. I got him. Summer smithing stone six, seven. Gravity chunk, gravity stone, and ball bearing. Very nice. All right, let's go to this. Let's go to the start. And then we will make our way out. Very nice. Let's go give this ball bearing to this lady. The table of lost grace. And then we'll go from there. Yeah, I think we... I think we got this one recently, and we got those now. That works for me. Grab that. We could grab this stuff. If that's what we need. Uh, but I don't think we need that though. I think that I think leveling up our our special spirits is just expensive. But we'll see. Greetings. Are you here for spirit? Greetings. Atena the Albernic. We still have seven, so we can keep going. It's just really expensive. Okay. So D has a brother. Likely so, sir. D has a brother. And that guy. He has gone to get with those who live in death. All right. Well, let's level up some other staves and see if those give us a bit more. Well, I took you no matter. It's all out your arm. Right there. So if we want to level up this, we need some various smithing stones, which we have plenty of. Goes to A. <laughs> we have enough, we just don't have money. So let's go to inventory. Mm. 
Use those ten. Those two thousand. That should be. Should be fine. Already as scaling that silver smith its own sevens. Okay, so let's compare these. Sixteen versus six. Let's see. So these only go. These special ones only go up to ten. These non-special ones go up to twenty-five. So roughly, if we were to do the calculation, it would be so ten equals twenty-five, right? Each one equals each level of the special one is worth is worth two point two point five. So, I mean, this one is effectively at, yeah, two and a half, right? So it'd be 12 plus, this would be at 18, this would be, it's the 16. Back over in matter. So can we strengthen this one? No. We need smithing stone sixes. I don't think we can buy those yet, but I think I can get them pretty easily. But, if we're going to use this for melee, and that for spell casting, we should go find out how much damage each one of those does. Which is why, again, I would really like a training dummy. So we can start looking at those things. Because there's nothing down here. down here just an abandoned part of the uh of the place okay so then grava tunnels we haven't been here yet uh i need to figure out how to open this front gate if we can It'd be nice if we could. Uh, but the place with the closest enemies to it that we could just test this on is probably here at front gate. At gate front. Specifically, the guys who use the uh, torches. Because the torch boys won't be able to block anything. Okay, well, the carrion slicer seems to do more damage. Kill, and it's all oh nice and it's all magic damage so that makes sense hello there friendo goodbye friendo yeah okay. 
that 355. 496 on the dogs. There's another wolf. There's another wolf around here. We killed the wolf eventually. Yeah, I think the carrying slicer is still going to do a lot more damage. So we will most likely keep it on for now. And if we decide to use like a. Uh, the cheese strat with the that specific spell I have in mind, which I know it's in this area, but I don't know anything else. <laughs> We've done pretty much everything else. So I'll, I'll double check that just so I know for sure. And we should also see if we can get over here and open that gateway. Is doing that, open that main gate and then go in and check out all that stuff. I hope it's not locked off from us now. That would kind of suck. This guy who would open it is no longer in this area. Well, let's see. We can probably still get the door open and go over there. I'm just not sure how exactly we'd go about doing that. But anyway, let's make sure we haven't missed anything. Alright, so we... No. Alright, so we know where we're going. I have an idea of what to do. I'm not sure if it will actually work. His dogs are grafted, but I think we just need to come through here and we can get over there. I'm not sure if that will work, but that's what my assumption is. Because if you talk to that dude in the beginning before he leaves, before you kill Godric the grafted, then he will open the way for you. But if you don't, then he, well, won't, because he won't know you're there. Okay. We just need to head down. I'm just curious. Thousand damage, eh? Huh? Oh my god. Let's go take out his road raid trends. Okay, sounds good. <laughs> so we need to go down there. These guys. Nice. Nice as well. <laughs> nice. Need to keep heading down. Not entirely sure how we will get there, but if we keep heading that direction. It might work out for us. Not entirely certain if that's true or not, but yeah, gotta do what you gotta do, I guess. Wouldn't great shit, I'm right there. Well, see you guys later. I don't think we've been down here yet. Since we're coming from the back way, 
They realize we're here. Huh? You douchebag. Ah. Yeah. Yeah. That's just a big motor box. Okay, let's get over here. Ah, okay, never mind. Ah. Let's heal this and. Okay, so we are in the front gates now. That's good. Is that a lion? That is a lion. Okay, that's fine. Where could it be? Mine shots us repeatedly. Cover. Okay, we're gonna need a little bit more healing. Again, how well can he aim that? We get around here. Yes. Sort of. Hello, buddy. Let's just know that we're not his buddy, pal. Oh, I see. We can't get to you now, can we? Does she come to us? Well, not everyone makes good decisions. Right, so... We can come down from up there. Which suggests that the doorway to get in there is around here somewhere. Then again, maybe not. Swimming stone ones. We are super over leveled for this area. Perfectly fine. Oh. Why, hello. No hostiles in here? That works. So, what is over here, then? Commoner's simple garb. Is that what you can see from down there? Because that's the dude. So I'm guessing they just offset this to over here. Sounds good. Then people spawn and they just get wrecked. By Ballista. Ballista bolts, golden beans, and golden beans. Lever up ahead, try. Oh, the lever to open the gate is up there. Oh, it's one of those. Sounds good. <laughs> yeah, I can see how someone gets up there. 
All right, so I don't know how how uh, fast Lion Boy is. All right, Lion Del. Lion Boy, you are made of. You, you don't hit very hard. Or at least you don't do very much stamina damage. Gotcha! He spot the whole thing. No. Man, he was intended to be fought at much, much, much lower level. Okay, sounds good. Ambush? No ambush. Center. Alright, nothing so far. Now is this the boss? Or something else? Let's just sit at bonfire. At the at the side of grace. <clears throat> okay, it's that familiar music again. The Bolt Drake Talisman. Probably lightning resist. Storm Hill. Still can't use torrent. Ah. How well this will work against you. Ah. Alright. We'll do it. Ooh, that's a one shot. Ah. But he can shoot his friend. And him being able to shoot his friend is important. We're gonna get hit. We won't get hit. If you can break their if you can break their poise, they die real easy. All right, it's time. To take this guy down. Yeah. Hopefully, I can move fast. Hopefully, I can dodge. Uh, but he doesn't do that much damage. So he's a dead man. He's a dead giant. Oh, we can just use this. Nice. Maybe right up to this one. I assume when they place it, it um, has a, uh, I believe the, I'm guessing the, anything that's above what would be its base would, would work against it. Okay, let's go see if there's anything back here. So I don't know if there is or not.
No, I don't know how to deal with you. Pickle fell, fell, but and everything else is just gone. Be wary, Stormhawk feathers. Yeah, that bridge is completely destroyed. All right, I wonder what made it uh, collapse like that. It's at the fun of games like Elden Ring, from Soft Games, everything's just destroyed, you're figuring out what's going on. Where it all started. Oh, we already know, right? The three di the four demigods started fighting over everything. Their chronic wars led to them destroying each other. One way or another. Precious item ahead. So, what is in here? Any fights? <laughs> Doesn't look like a yes. Didn't expect up. Oh. Likely a liar. Alright. What's up here then? The grace of gold everywhere. Gold and silver. It is very pretty. Let's slip back down just in case we need to go back. We don't need to. <clears throat> Got our lost grace again. Restore the power of the great room. Godric's great room. First off, I guess. Got all these weird straggly hairs on them. Are they plants? Maybe. Hmm. Okay, so God's Rick's great room. So now a usable item. No. Raises all attributes. The great rune of the shard bearer Godric is bless its blessing raises all attributes. The great rune is known as an as the anchor ring. Found in the center of the Elden Ring. The first demigods were the Elden Lord Godfrey and his offspring, the Golden Lineage. So what if we use one of these rune arc? We're an equipped great rune upon use. Do we have to put the great rune somewhere? Or is it just if the rune is in our inventory, it counts as equipped?
everywhere below. All right then. Well, we've done that. I'm I'm guessing that each time you die, you have to go and do that again. Maybe, maybe not. Okay, so. Let's go over here, because there is the... There are the duelists that you can fight in this arena, in this area, I think. We got Monsieur Ager. We can just sort of... Uh, we can just sort of ignore him and skip him and move past. Ah! No, that's a one-shot. We have to sit and wait for this guy to be done. Then I think we can go talk to the Great Pass, and I think he has an item for us. We just need to maybe kill some people. Because he talked about three duelists or something like that beforehand, I think. So I read something about duelists. So these all supposed to be a manifestation of the greater will? Hello, you. You're going to die. Oh. Okay, he double triple hits. He's one of those enemies who double hits. Yeah, the better option would be to not have them double hit and just have them do like double damage. Everybody can shoot at this, right? Alright, die you bastard. Oh yeah, now he can get to us. Him shoot, and then we need to move up. Probably to here. Cool. Now we can move in on him. Let's move forward a bit. He's gonna vomit fire. It 
This one's good. Okay. I would like a something over here with a great pot. Great pot have anything to say? Can't hurt it. Can't talk to it. Can't target it. Are there specific enemies in here? We need to activate summon signs. Mm, I can't activate summon signs here. Okay, so. I know that there's supposed to be some dudes that we can summon to fight, so that's about all that I know, though. There's the blood stains. Hmm. I'm assuming they're out here. I'm not sure if they are or not. But I'm assuming they are, so we'll make a a lap at the set a route. A lap, I guess. Make a circuit. Okay, nothing here. Blood stains over here where people have jumped off, presumably. I mean, I'd expect them to be over here, right? But then they're not showing up. Can I go inside of here? No. Alright then. Well, I know there's supposed to be dudes out here that I can, like, summon and fight. I just don't know where they are. Two of the four corners are in a with wall walls, no rock up dropping, crouching or blocking. These spots often cause the NPCs.
But so you can talk to him. But we already talked to him. But I'm not sure where he actually wants us to go. Okay, so I'm assuming it's supposed to be here then. Do we summon them or does is is it bugs? Do we have to Do we have to be a certain distance away to use this and then go in there or something? I'm very confused. Maybe we have to get far away from them, I guess. And then come back with that on. Maybe that's what has to happen. Yeah, let's turn that on. And let's go back. Let's see what he has to say. Maybe we have to unload the area and then reload it. Maybe that will get him to show back up. Okay, now can we talk to him? Because there's clearly a lot of stuff here. Is it if you... Just read some inside. Is that one of them we have to fight? So see three red summon signs. Night of the Great Jar. Night of the Great Jar and Night of the Great Jar. Okay, so it's worked now. So let's summon this guy and fight him. <clears throat> Hello, Mr. Knight. Oh no, he can parry us, that's right. Hmm. Yeah, that's a bit vocal. Okay, sounds good. We'll probably not do it. <laughs> <laughs> Until later. Because he has a uh, he has a lot of health. So if we were playing a non-mage, we would probably go do it, but otherwise, nah. Okay, so we've seen what that is. I think we have everything else that we needed. Oh yeah, so what else is there out here that we have not discovered? Is there anything out in, like, this desert? I mean... Okay, that's where we find him. And there's stuff down here that we found.
There's evidently another uh, site down here. What else? It's another cookbook. Another weapon. Okay. Beyond that, there's something over here. The dead, the war dead catacombs. I'm not sure if you access that from like Lena's Rise area or. down there, but it's. It's kind of like here. So let's try going to Rena's Rise and see if we can get down there from from there and then we'll go to the castle and just ride up there. If we can't get there from Rena's Rise, then we will not Rena's Rise from whatever this place is. Actually, let's see. There seems to be a cave entrance down there. Because it's one big boss arena, so it wouldn't necessarily make a whole lot of sense for it to be there. But it could be that over there. Not sure how we would get up there. Well, I have an idea of how we would get up there. Or how we would get down there. So where is this? It's like down there. There could be a jumping puzzle to get down there. So it must be beneath us. We've got all these jars. It might also be just be behind the earth tree. And another dungeon was. Same thing over here. No, oh, wonderful. Hello, friends. Okay, sounds good. We might need to actually go into the boss room, which we probably can get down there if we use the Renner's Rise jump in a completely unintended way. <laughs> but we'll see. Unless the map is off and it's actually way closer to us. Okay. So we need to be right on the edge of it, I think. Oh! <laughs> In other words, they said, yeah, we need to try. <laughs> I kind of don't want to go into the boss room just to ride up there, though. That seems like a complete pain in the ass. So I'm kind of hoping that's just them not having it accurate on the map. Because otherwise, it would just be a pain in the ass. 
Hmm. I'm hoping it would be over here, but it's not. I mean, we could jump down there, but there's no way for us to get down there. At least not that makes sense. I, mean, I can always look up how to get in there. Unless this has something to do with the No it doesn't. This is that's just the lower area down there. Ah oh, great. Alright, we'll just look up how to get in there, because I'm tired of this. Okay, so how do I actually get in there? It's in the boss arena. I guess that makes sense. Okay, so we just go to the boss arena, we go north, and uh, then we're good. My assumption is that it is, like, locked off in the boss arena. So these people could technically run in there. It'd be funny if that was an inch- it'd be funny if that was a cheese strat, of course. Not really a whole lot to talk about. Just moving from point A to point B. Maybe it's here, maybe it isn't. Oh, I see something over there. War dead cascoons. Sounds good. So, what's down here then? All right, just a pit. Nice. Always a good sign. All right, these guys are fighting each other endlessly. Sounds great. Okay, they're above us. My assumption is that once they see us, they'll all lock onto us. Okay, so. Can't go up there, we can go over here, though. Yeah, people are shooting at us. Brave Glove Wars. We'll most likely get one shot if something hits us. 
And that is the bar store. That explains why it's so easy to get over here. Okay, so let's go over there and see if we can figure out what's over here. Victorious. Nice to see you again. Okay, so we're a little higher. Let's go and just see what we can find out here. What is that behind us? No. Get those guys. What do you do? Gotcha. Yeah, that works. Right, it looks like they are finally killing each other off. You're wary of weak though. Yes. Oh no, we're dead. Yeah, because as I said, everything here will one shot us. It doesn't matter what they use. Okay, but we might be able to get away with a little bit more freedom if we swap that out with this and then the hidden body. That could be useful to us. We've got the big melee going. Just want to move up here, go around, and avoid that. Nice. 